is called an Aoki lock. It's a modified heel hook, but jujitsu is for autistic people. What I think of a master of jujitsu is is somebody that inspires another generation. Jujitsu, I swear, this is why I like striking. This is so. And this is a competition where you just—it's an art, and it's an art form. But I learned from the master. He looks like Mark Zuckerberg. He shouldn't be winning. So that's like a master to student. He's an idol of mine for being. <laughs> It's like a master to the student. Um, actually, this is a leg heel lock. He's saying he would make me tap. He probably would. He probably would. So today I'm going to talk about bullies. Bullies are weak people that make fun of others around them, that give themselves relevance, and that make themselves feel good. They pick on the differences of humans, which is the most beautiful part of humans, their uniquenessness. I really don't like bullies, guys. And there's this guy named Sneeko making fun of me. Making fun of my friend, making fun of jiu-jitsu. He calls himself a boxer. I'm a jiu-jitsu guy. Let's have an MMA fight. I challenge Nico to an MMA fight. I'm going to shut his mouth and I'm going to take the bully's lunch money. A week ago, my life flashed before my eyes. I don't think he has it in him to choke me out. How much do you weigh? 125. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh. I didn't think it was that bad until almost every single major sports network reposted it. Hard, jump, hard, 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 hard. So, there we have it. Sneeko is insulting Mikey Musumeci, a five-time world champion. That's insane, because in the past, if you would insult someone, you would probably have to fight them. Sometimes today that could happen as well, but not really. It's not really the same case. There were repercussions in the past for talking nonsense to people. And so doing that here, Sneeko's going to have the last laugh, isn't he? He's going to be able to say whatever he wants to say. And at the end of it, Mikey Musumeci has to live with it. It's unfortunate. It's unfortunate. That's the time we live in, a time where people can say whatever they want and there is no repercussion for doing so. Free speech is important. But when, when you're blatantly insulting people for no, no other gain but relevance, especially when you yourself have no capacity to actually fight that person. Sneeko's technique wasn't that bad, but he has no umph in his strikes. He's very slow. He would definitely get destroyed by Mikey Musumeci in an instant. Mikey Musumeci is dealt with bigger guys. It'd be a very, very easy fight. And as we saw, a boxer versus a BJJ guy. Boxing, not just boxing. Anyone versus BJJ and they don't know what they're doing. They'll probably lose to it just because of the knowledge advantage. It takes advantage of the lack of understanding. It'd be an easy win for him. But that's just the time we live in today. And... Behavior like this, being outlandish, saying things that are inflammatory, polarizing, with no, nothing backing it up. It's often rewarded in this time. It goes rewarded in this time. I understand if it's two people fighting each other. If trash talk happens with two people fighting each other, it's war. And in war, you do what you can to win. But even then, Respect is always appreciated. It is what it is. It's the world we live in today. A sign of the times. What do you think of Sneeko's trash talk towards Mikey Musumeci? He get destroyed. Those were fighting words. But, hey, he got away. Peace.